got the opportunity to meet uh, some of the good folks from Brassville and Gory from a local developer, uh, one of the prominent developers in Greenville. Having the opportunity to meet with those guys at, at that time was like a dream come true for me. Uh, I had heard of Brassfield and Gory before, um, but hadn't had a chance to really get to know um, anybody from the organization. An obvious first step for us is to create opportunity and to open doors for firms that can um, get that first job, get that first opportunity. Um, we have a plenty of work that would be ideal for that. Public, private, it doesn't matter, but when you see a job that has the opportunity to include somebody new to this, uh, to our relationship network, we need to do that. Brassfield and Gory saw the importance of inclusion, and we had the opportunity to come to the table on a 108,000 square foot tented up fit in downtown Greenville, South Carolina, a 20 plus million dollar project that is extremely high profile. Uh, so even the thought of getting involved in something like that at, at my company size, just being a grain of sand, it really uh, blew my mind. Uh, important to mention that there weren't any mandates on this project, but B&G did it because it was the right thing to do. And to say that it was a game changer would really be minimizing the opportunity. It was for us um, the thing that really put us on the map. We need to embrace everybody when we do work. This is important for us to reach out, be proactive, to make a difference, to give people a chance to succeed and uh, I, I hope we will be recognized for being a company that really takes the leadership area in this, in this effort. There's nothing in, in Brassfield and Gore's culture that would foster anything but support of a, of a firm that was trying to become a uh, standalone company. And we'd do everything we could once we see somebody is trying to do that. We could have been looked at as uh, just a subcontractor to come in and just perform uh, an area of, of, of the scope. And I would have been happy with that. Um, but what was decided was, you know what, your goal is to learn how to uh, run a company. So let's bring you in at a high level so you get to experience everything that is, uh, is important to setting up and executing on a successful project. Our focus of this initiative, of this opportunity, is to really expand the awareness and to create new relationships and to start the process of building relationships and bridging the gaps that where we don't have relationships. And I, I really hope everyone will think through how they can have an impact and how we can collectively really broaden our base, both internally and externally, how we can have better, stronger, deeper relationships all across the board. As a minority firm, you know, you fight for an opportunity. Uh, but then after you get an opportunity to have somebody that is willing to show you um, how to perform, is something that just doesn't happen. Uh, the learning hasn't stopped. And the conversation has always been, if you need us, we're available to you. One of my real hopes for this objective is that people will be challenged to think and to ask themselves how they're doing in this area of our company because this isn't going to be successful by a mandate. This is only going to be successful if we all agree, understand, and are willing to invest their time. And, and my hopes are that everybody throughout the company will be more intentional and do it with the understanding of why we're doing it because it's, it is what we need to be doing. And I hope everyone can see that and will embrace that and to join our effort into being a more diverse and inclusive company from every area of our company. For Brasswood and Gory to continue to do uh, these types of programs, the mentoring, the engaging with small minority businesses, the ripple effect that that could have on the entire construction industry, I don't even think could be uh, monetized. We're not just talking about making a difference to um, a, a community, we're talking about making a difference to an entire culture.